I'm Jack Dillenberg, and I'm the inaugural dean of the Arizona School of Dentistry and Oral Health. When we started this wonderful school, uh, there were a couple things that were guiding principles that we followed some of the thinking of Andrew Taylor Still, the founder of osteopathic medicine and his sensitivity to patients and wanting to make a difference and wanting to serve. You know, whole person healthcare uh, relates to what we do in a very significant way because now the research has shown that our model is effective and right on track because so many health issues are linked and associated with the oral cavity. ASDO was the second school in the United States to have social workers working on the clinic floor side by side with our students. Why? Because patients come to dental schools with other issues than just their dental problems. They are poverty, obesity, substance abuse, victims of domestic violence, all sorts of issues that they have that our doctors, our student dentists need to be aware of for them to be effective. Otherwise, they're just two technicians. And that's not what this healthcare system needs now. We need to produce healthcare professionals with emphasis on oral health that understand that linkage, that understand and have the confidence to reach out and talk to osteopathic physicians, allopathic physicians, PAs, other healthcare providers with that understanding and knowledge of how it all interrelates in a whole person healthcare environment. Our students go out to rotation sites, community clinics throughout the United States, from the East Coast to the West Coast, from North to South, where they have the opportunity in a mentored environment with an adjunct faculty member that's been calibrated, that has been selected because they're caring, they're compassionate, they they want to be part of enriching the experience of this young professional to help create that caring, compassionate healthcare provider for the future.